So for my final project, I did an iron-on fractal. A fractal is a curve or a geometric figure, each of which has the same statistical character as a whole. Here are some images of fractals. And I, what I did is a iron-on tree fractal. A technique that I use is using the variable size and level inside of the code. So the size makes it, so I put it as size 20, and the size makes it to where you can have it either bigger or smaller, depending on what number you choose to put it in. And the level is, um, the level is choosing how many times you want it to build on itself. So I'm going to put in, let's say, the number 1, and it's going to just put a line. And if I do 2, it will make a Y shape, and I'm going to go up to, let's say, level 5. And it will build on itself, curving using the turn degrees that I told it to do. And the fract the level that I did was level seven, and so it makes it like that. And I put it on a sweatshirt. The thing that I learn new is using the code inside itself. So the tree size, as you can see here. I put it inside the if else block, like inside itself. Um, what I've learned that connects to what we have done in class this year, um, it connects to it by using different ways and shortcuts to make the coding a lot faster instead of doing using a whole bunch of moves and a whole bunch of turns. It just has everything right in that one code. And so that's what I did for my final project.